Rise and shine, sweetheart. Yeah, I figured I'd wake you up nice today. With a kiss from your prince. Nah, you king. You know I can't do things halfway. We gotta leave soon, bud. I made you breakfast. I caught these suckers on the way. Oh, right. You're not into this. Uh, just ignore that. Um, maybe I hunt a little too much. But even then, to think you'd have such refined taste. Truly befitting of my mate. Hey, are you happy with our travels? I know we're doing it for necessity reasons. We have to save ourselves from those damn gods. But even then, it feels exciting, exhilarating to be away. I just hope everybody's okay. Gotta trust Kiri on that one, huh? As for the rest of it, we need to figure out what's going on and how we're gonna get out, you know? Well, you okay? We can always take to the skies if things get dicey. But even then, I don't know, something about camping out with you makes me want to take my time. I haven't been this happy since I can remember. Being under these skins with you, the fur is nice, but your warmth is nicer. You know, we might be cold-blooded, but I still feel the warmth. I still want to feel more of your warmth. I guess we're not cold-blooded when you think of our breath. It's like a fire of magic burning deep inside. And the more I think of the world around us, the more I think, damn, we're kind of badass, you know? I don't want to get too informal or too complacent. But at this point, I wouldn't mind laying here all day with you. We can still make it there, to the north, where everything's gonna go down. If they still exist, that is. Those, the cursed ones, as everybody calls them. I don't understand why. Doesn't seem like they did anything, but judging from those gods, they'll call anyone cursed. They called us that. And even if we're all damned, we'll be damned together, you know? Hey, babe. You okay? I just have to check on you. Make sure that you're still happy. Not getting ahead of myself too much, am I? Hey. Another kiss. <laughs> Never said I wasn't greedy. And you saw the way those cat folk were looking at you. I don't want to share. <laughs> that intrigue, that excitement that they had seeing you. And I'm afraid I can't let them get away with it. <laughs> they don't know what hit them. And by the time I'm done with them, I'll make sure of it. You can bet. I mean, think about it. We're at the top of the food chain. If you exclude those crazy ones and that damn Deku, I still can't forgive him for what he did. We used to be friends, and now, look at us. Look at this whole mess of a world we're in. I think he's still in there somewhere, but I can't forgive someone who hurts my baby. <laughs> my fire. The fire in my heart, that's you. And I'm sick, deep down. I'm angry that I can't solve all the problems, but somehow when I hold your hand and I look right into your eyes, I think that the problems will just solve themselves. Or that we can take it on together and things just get better, you know? That's all I want. I never wanted to rule the world. I never wanted to take down the gods. Sounds so tedious when you say it out loud. They're annoying. I just... I want things to be okay. For you. I want to be okay too. I want to have fun again. I want to be free. I don't want to be cooped up with our brethren. 
cistern, whatever it's called for the rest of those non-binary dragons too. But uh, I don't want anyone to take away what we got, you know. I want to be happy with you. And to think I could have eaten you. <laughs> you disappointed I didn't? I sure as hell am. I'm only disappointed. I can't have more of you right now. <laughs> what do you mean, who says? Well, if someone isn't getting more sassy by the day, getting the hang of everything, you'd tell me if you weren't, right? Hey, I know being an eternal being and all that is a lot of responsibility, but you're different. You still got that heart in there. I don't think I ever had one, but I like to think that you helped me find something like it. Even if it's not perfect, even if there's a lot to it that I don't understand it. And these feelings that I put away for so long after I lost my mom. After I lost so many of the people that I loved, I locked my heart away. But look at you. Looks like you had the key. Or you picked the lock, <laughs> little scoundrel. Look at you. <laughs> I know you can't actually look at yourself without magic. I'm not telling you to do that either. Hey, is this some kind of joke? <laughs> Making a joke out of what I said. I was being serious, dumbass. I'm serious about you. I'm serious about us. I'm serious about fixing this damn world. And I'm serious about this trip we're on being one of the best fucking times I've ever had. Being royalty and all that. Everybody envies you. They try and be like you. Or they try and steal your throne. But no matter what they do, they don't realize what they're vying for. Until they already got it and then they're miserable. And that's what makes another bad ruler after the next. One after the other. They kill each other off and keep going. That's what power is. Power screws up everything. If those gods didn't have the power that they have, then none of this would have happened the way it did. All those people turned to stone. All those lost moments. All those everything. Sure, I don't really feel bad for them. They were the ones that betrayed us. They're why I hated the humans. But now I can't hate them as much. I hate the ones who did it. I think they deserved it. My mother. <sighs> she deserved better than that. And I just wish I could do something. I don't know what it's like being gone from here. When you're something eternal. When you're so kind you get yourself into a trap. I don't know what that's like, unless you're a trap then. I will fully grant you whatever you want. You can take it all from me, because if you ain't real, then I don't want this world anymore. Yeah, that's not words a king should be saying, but I don't care. Even if everybody else in this damn world has something to say about it, calls me lazy, calls me neglectful, I don't care. Because if I can't have you, if I can't rule this world with you, or at least be free in it, then I don't want it. I never wanted it. It's a lot of responsibility, you know. Being vengeful and all that. It kind of sucks. <laughs> hey, beautiful. Yeah. I don't want you thinking that means that I'm bitter or that I resent you for your past or even that I hate the humans. I know you got family back there, even if you don't want to admit it. Even if everything was the way it was, it doesn't mean you can't go back. 
I mean, you might not be the same, but... We can visit, I guess. After we take care of these things, we have to get the snakes out of the pot or whatever they say. Look, I, I don't know the phrase when those cat folks said it. It happened two days ago, so don't expect much. Sh shut up. Dumbass. <laughs> Is that what you wanted? Was I being too sweet for your liking? <laughs> I'm kidding. I like you. And I love you. But one thing I'll never be is not true to myself. You really think I could live a day without speaking my mind and telling all these sons of bitches what I think about them? <laughs> I can't wait to take down those gods to, to rescue my friend and save this world. Yeah, I won't forgive him, but I will save him. I owe him that much. He was there for me. And nobody else was way back when. Time flies by like leaves falling out of a tree in autumn. But even then, I can't. I can never forget certain things. Sometimes I wish us magical creatures could forget. But no, it's not like that. It's never like that. Hey, baby. Since you won't eat this, uh, I, I guess, will this do? Uh, it's foraged from around here, too. It was my backup plan. Yeah, even I have those sometimes. Can't be too sure when I'm dealing with the best. <laughs> hey, thanks for trusting me. I know that sometimes it's easy to get fired up about things, to want to do things too quickly or whatever, but thanks for cooling me down and being patient with me. Thanks for letting me grow on my own and with you, for giving me the space I need and the love I need, the support and all that. Look, this cave might not be the biggest, but I'm kind of cozy here. Feels kind of awesome, actually. Mm. What's with that look? Yeah, no. I, I get it. We could run away from our problems, but... And then we'd never be able to forgive ourselves if something did happen, right? Yeah, not our responsibility, but... But those are friends. Family. People we care about even if we don't know why. That's what it means to protect something, you know? I know I got a reputation for it. <laughs> the Golden Dragon of Death. <laughs> I've got cooler nicknames than that. Don't let that one fool you. That one's just because of my hair, I think. Well, and because I'll go into human form when I fight sometimes. <laughs> Why not? Isn't it too unfair if I'm ten times their size or a thousand times their size? It doesn't really matter to me, but I feel a little bit guilty if I'm picking on little people like that. I mean, come on. What are they going to do? Shove a sword in my mouth? Give me a toothache or something? <laughs> yeah, they can try. But good luck piercing this skin. Down to my gums, I'm actually pretty durable. As you no doubt found out last night. <laughs> What's the matter? Can't poke fun at something that you had? <laughs> I could use a little more loving right now. Hey, gorgeous. My mate. What if we don't leave this cave? What if we partake in rituals as old as time itself? Love. God. Sometimes it pisses me off hearing that word, even if I like the feeling of it. Yeah, I like your love, but... Damn, it's frustrating. It's cramping my style, you know? 
I never thought I'd fall in love. My damn... Damn old lady was right. Every time. I'm always wrong. I get tired of it too, you know. Being wrong all the time. I try and learn. But it's hard. Not because I don't want to. But because when I do learn, I feel like I'm doing it wrong. Have I done this love well? Have I done things justice? You and I, and all the things we went through. Are we... okay? Did you enjoy it? Look, what I'm trying to say is... This isn't as easy as I thought. Mm. All right, screw it. You love me, right? Then... I guess what I'm asking is, am I good enough? Do I make you feel... Look... I might be some dumb sky lizard who doesn't know a thing about love... other than what I've experienced, and... I want to make sure you feel this love. That it's not just a love you can brush off like it's nothing. Not a love that's weak. Not one that makes you feel unsafe. I want you to know. I would have never agreed to any of this if I didn't value you. I would have never taken the step. I would have remained in my old ways forever. <sighs> you know, you really get me in certain ways. And then in others, you just don't got a clue, do you? <laughs> I don't mind that side of you. In fact, it's pretty fucking cute. The way that you care, even if you don't understand your own feelings sometimes. <laughs> Guess that makes two of us. We really are. Kinda... special. I really like it. Well, I'm glad you ended up by my side. I'm glad it wasn't anyone else. Because there isn't anybody else that would do. Isn't that obvious? I wouldn't be out here fawning over just anyone, dumbass. Shut up. You can't tease me. Just how would you even try? <laughs> hey, bold. Hey. Get closer. It's gonna be a windy blizzard. And sure, we could just fly through it, but... These blankets, they feel a little nice, don't they? It's cozy, and well, I just want to stay here. Feel you next to me, at least a little longer, you know? Hey, I said I'm greedy, and you're my treasure. Get used to it already. You want to go around the world with me? And let's go around the world without ever leaving these sheets. You don't get it, do you, dumbass? I'm saying I want you more than anything. The world can fuck off for all I care. It's you that I want to make this place better for. Yeah, sure. Maybe the memory of my mom and all of that plays a role, but... As much as I hate to admit it, my mom's alive right here. I learned from her. Even if she herself had a lot to learn, you know? We learn and sometimes it's too late. But is it really? I'd say no. I learned both from her mistake and from her kindness. And from you, dumbass. You... <sighs> What's the point of even saying it? 
When it's you, you get it without me even mentioning it. That's right. You get me. I'm fucking glad you do. I'm really glad that I've got you. <laughs> I'm glad you never seem to change either. You better not. Even joking about it is a crime. <laughs> Don't make me rewrite the laws when we get home. Or I'll make it like that. <laughs> you gonna go to the Sky Island with me? Have a fun time and watch the stars at the top of the world? <laughs> I like the sound of that. Or some random field. Holding your hand and... You're always so cocky, dumbass. Always knowing when my weak spot's showing. <laughs> Fine. Suit yourself. If that's how you feel, then so be it, dumbass. However you feel, it's okay. I learned that from you. Be patient and take it slower, right? That's why I woke you up kind this morning. Because I thought I'd learn a little thing or two. Thought you'd be impressed. Instead you tease back. You're impossible sometimes. But I guess that's part of your charm, isn't it? If you're that impossible, then how could I ever stay mad at you? Just getting frustrated and then... Jeez, to hell. <laughs> Don't think I like that or anything, dumbass. No. I just like your company. Probably way too much. So shut up and give me more of it. <laughs> there, I said it. <laughs> You're pretty cute. Just like this. Hey. No turning this on me, dumbass. You can't do that to me. You try to. I'll put on the moves. I'll make you regret it. Dumbass. You're so playful. So damn cute. It should be illegal. It should be something you can't be like that how can you be both so cute and so frustrating at the same time that's what you wanted isn't it to piss me off and then make me so happy i don't even know what to do with myself right because that's what you always fucking do dumbass <laughs> Who's a sky lizard now? You're the one without a brain, dumbass. <laughs> yeah, say whatever you want. Oh, really? Now we're making threats, huh? Well, fine. I'll make a threat. You keep this up, and that tail is mine. <laughs> <laughs> Not so tough now, are you? <laughs> Real cute and easy to talk to. And I could get lost talking to you for the whole fucking day. Maybe I will. Maybe that's what you want, huh? <laughs> You're as transparent as me. I kind of like that. Hey. You're gorgeous. And well, I'm happy I get to be with you. Like this. <laughs> Nothing makes me more happy. Nothing. <laughs> I never thought I could be a simpleton, but I guess I was all along. Looking high and far and wide in all kinds of different places. Through the clouds and ground and even beneath it. I've never met someone like you. <laughs> I think I was always looking for you. 
Yeah, I suck at romance, but... <clears throat> Catching me off guard, huh? You'll regret that, dumbass. I trust you. And that's probably the hardest thing to say. Because I don't trust anyone, usually. I'm sick of people disappointing me. And, well, I'm glad that you don't. Wouldn't know what to do if you did, you know. If you disappointed me, then the whole world would disappoint me so fucking much more. <laughs> but you can't be a disappointment. Not at this point. You've already saved me from the worst fate, losing my heart. You... <laughs> My mom would be thanking you right now. It's crazy. I can't even think of what my dad would say. <sighs> well, at least it's different now. I know what you're thinking. Sob stories be damned, right? Why are you so interested in this anyways? Hey, dumbass. You want to fess up? Why are you so into me in the first place? I'm glad you are, but... But still... Am I really that attractive to you? <sighs> if it seems like I'm complaining, then no. I'm just used to being called a fiery hothead who doesn't have anything going on in my brain. Get made fun of that way, at least by the people bold enough to dare to try. But even then... I think it's kind of true. I do have a lot of anger issues. A lot of things I struggle with, too. <sighs> Look at me. That's it, baby. You don't have to say anything. But your eyes tell me that you accept me. And that matters more than I could ever explain. Because... Knowing that we accept each other for all of our faults and everything we are. And that's what I believe true love is, you know. You just have to do your best, you know. And pieces fall into place. Or at least that's what that idiot was always saying. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Everyone teaches you a lesson, right? But only the ones that you want to keep near can teach you the most special ones of all. If you can do that, things get interesting, you know? You get the ability to actually do something with your time, with your feelings. The world opens up, like opening a giant door. Only that door leads to an endless, boundless sky. That's so much. So many possibilities. And you? Baby, you're like the key that let me out of my cage. You're that one thing that keeps me wanting to smile. Even on days when I swear I don't want to. When I convince myself. <sighs> you know what, dumbass? Just don't regret making me fall in love with you. Because I'll never regret Never once. So you better not, either. Words always seem cheap. But with you, I believe them. You're the one I trust. The one who holds my heart in the palm of your hand. Just please treat it well. I don't want to lose anyone else special to me. I don't want to be betrayed. I don't want things to become sad again. I just want it to be happy. And for us to get our happily ever after. <laughs> if this was a fairy tale, then I'd ask only for one thing. That I could hold the sand forever. That I could look in these gorgeous eyes and know that they're looking straight at me. And 
I could feel the warmth of your hand in mine and truly know that this is where you'd be even if you could be anywhere or anything. That's what I want. You. Yeah. It's that simple, dumbass. Hey, why are you looking at me like that? You little... Fine, then. You want to act like that, then? Maybe we won't get out of bed yet. Maybe I got to teach you a lesson or two. Don't you let go. You... You're my crown, my treasure, and my dreams all wrapped into one. I think it's time you take advantage, more responsibility for what you've done. <laughs> I don't know which one it's going to be with you. That's why I said both. Who's gonna win and who's gonna lose? Or is there really a winner or a loser in love? <laughs> I guess the only way we find out is just like this. I love holding you like this. I love it so much. <laughs> But clearly, I'm not the only one. Look at that face. Hey, don't look away. You really look cute like that. Well, what about here? Enough already? I didn't think so. Me either, baby. Holding you, kissing you. <laughs> That's just the tip of the iceberg, ain't it? I want to do everything with you, baby. Everything. So much, and you're the only mate for me. You hear me? And I'll cry to the heavens if I have to, and shove it down the throat of those gods. And you're mine. Night, Sharon. Look at me, baby. <laughs> do you like your Dragon King? Or do you love me? I love you, baby. You're really the fire that sets me ablaze. Makes all my desires happen. Makes me feel like I'm actually alive. Instead of just going through the motions, you make me feel happy. You make me feel whole. And I'm never letting go, baby. Never and no matter what. I love you. I love you so much. Will you be mine forever? <laughs> of course I'll be yours. Don't mad. <laughs> you 
really know everything there is to me, <laughs> is what I would say. But it's not over yet. Nah, I got my fair share of surprises. Like you're gonna find out, dumbass. <laughs> Did you really think I'd let you have all that fun and not keep some trump cards hidden? Nah, don't worry about it, baby. Just trust me, okay? I'm your man. I'm your dragon. And I'm your king. Figure one of those might make you feel something. <laughs> Come on, don't be such a harsh crowd today. Dumbass. Making me blush like that. And here I was thinking you were playing coy. But nah, I should have known better. You little... <laughs> I'm ready to give up yet? No, you're not. <laughs> That's it, dumbass. <laughs> Who's a dumbass now? What do you mean I say it too much? Well, I mean... You might have a point. I don't have the best vocabulary, so maybe I'll try and learn some intrinsic words. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck it means, but shut up. You don't either, do you? Doesn't matter, dumbass. All that matters is you and me. So from here on out, I'll make you look at me. I'll steal your attention, steal your gaze, and make sure every little thing is wonderful. I love you so fucking much. And I think you know it. But I want you to accept that that you do deserve it. You deserve to be happy. And you deserve my love even more than I did. I want to make you the happiest in this whole goddamn world. And until then, and after then, I'm going to be going 100 million percent forward and I'm gonna hold you and I'm gonna make you think of me I'm gonna make you mine in ways nobody else could I'm going to make you happy I swear it be mine Forever. Got it? <laughs> That's it. That's my baby. <laughs> you didn't think I could leave you and just let you fall asleep again, did you? Not yet. Though I guess for now, if you have to fall asleep, you should do so in my arms. Good problem. Didn't think so, honey. <laughs> now just relax. I don't make a bad pillow, do I? A little on the hard side, but... Hey, what you thinking about? I didn't mean it like that. Dumbass. Hey, you watch yourself, or else... <laughs>